people are saying that NEET 2025 will be full of surprises. Even I have heard from a lot of students out there saying, sir, we are expecting that there will be the hybrid model because there were some websites which have published this previously. And these were some of the suggestions given by that committee which was found by the NTA previously. Uh, that is Radha Krishnan committee, okay? Now in this particular video, we'll be addressing each and every single point. What are the rumors that are going in the country right now? And what are the things that we are expecting? Will this be, will this need 2025 be full of surprises? And will there be hybrid model? Will there be online examination? Okay. Will there be any age limit? A lot of students are texting, sir, what is the age limit for the NEET 2025? We recently heard that there will be the age limit that we are expecting in the upcoming time. Will there be two phases in the exam like you have J mains and advanced? Similarly, sir, can we expect over here? Now, my dear friends, previously you know that when it comes to the NEET 2024, there were a lot of errors. Okay. We are not going to discuss those once again because we know each and every single detail about those. But recently, a conference happened in which Education Minister of India, he said that we are not going to expect any sort of, we will not tolerate any sort of error in the NEET 2025. So, for that, they have made the committee previously, that is the Radha Krishnan committee, okay, they asked them to suggest what are the things we are supposed to implement in the upcoming time for the NEET 2025 so that there will be no errors so that we can streamline this NEET 2025 examination in the upcoming time because we, we have seen more than 25 lakh students appear every single year in this particular examination. So that's why we cannot expect those things which happened in the 2024, whatever it may be, we cannot expect those in the NEET 2025. Now, my dear friends, let me tell you each and every single thing in this particular video. What are the rumors that are going on? What are the things that a uh, lot of websites have published previously? And, and what are the things that you can expect in the NEET 2025? We'll be figuring that out properly each and every single detail. And make sure you hit the like button. You share this video with all of your friends out there. Now, my dear friends, the very first thing over here is, see, as I told you, they have previously made a committee, the name of the committee is Radha Krishnan Committee. So, they came up with some suggestions so that we can streamline this exam in the NEET 2025. Like we say, changes suggested, expected. Hybrid model, okay. Uh, we say two-phase exam. What is this hybrid model? Hybrid model is basically like you have the paper uh, on the computer and then you are supposed to fill the OMR sheet, okay, with your pen and paper. Okay, that's a kind of hybrid model I can say. Then you have the two phases exam. They said, if we can, these are not the things which have happened. No, no, no. These are the, we say, things which they have suggested, okay, the Radha Krishnan committee. Two phase exam like you have in J, you have the two phase exam. Similarly, they said you can go for the two phase exam. Like phase one, if they qualify this phase, then they can move on to the next phase and they can give, rest of the students can give the next exam. Okay. Then we have the online testing. Shift this uh, completely to the online mode. Okay. And then we say there has to be the age and attempt limit. Okay. Make sure you check the age properly and there has to be the attempt limit means how many number of attempts a student can give. So these were the main things I would say which were suggested by the Radha Krishnan committee to the NTA so that they can implement these to streamline the, we say, examination in the NEET 2025. Okay. Now, my dear friends, when these Things when these points were suggested by the Radha Krishnan committee, there was an ac activist. His name was Vivek. He came up with, he basically filed a petition, okay? And, and in that petition, he opposed some of the points in this one. Like the first thing he opposed that, he said there should be no age limit and when it comes to the attempt limit over here, okay? And he opposed this online testing also because he said there are a lot of things which are economically weak. Okay, there are a lot of, lot of students who are economically weak, okay? They belong to the economically weaker backgrounds. We say for those students, it will be difficult for them to give the examination online because they haven't used the computer before. So they are seeing this for the first time. How can you expect from those students, even they'll get nervous in the examination hall, okay? They won't be able to solve the questions or, or crack this particular examination. So she said, we are not supposed, you guys are not, uh, uh, we suggest you not to basically implement these things as of now, but in the upcoming time you may, but not right now over here. Like you can completely see, completely see the detail exactly given over here. Okay, he completely criticized it. 
So we say number of attempts if we talk about currently. Sir, is there any limit? We say there are there are no limits. Okay, there is no limit when it comes to the number of attempts. Okay, you can give any number of attempts. Okay, previously they have uh, in in some year I guess they have uh, they changed this number of limits and they made it some three or four I guess I'm not sure about that. But uh, finally after that year they again changed it to you can give any number of attempts. That's not a problem. Okay, now we have attempts. To be re reduced to three they were saying that make it basically three attempts only and then my dear friends when it comes to the age limit we say no upper age limit as of now okay but what they are saying that what they are saying that we say 17 years by december this has to be the lower age limit so this is what they suggested actually in that particular case okay and my dear friends my dear friends when it comes to the concerns over multi-session online examination, in his letter, Pandey reportedly raised alarms about the proposed online multi-session exam format. He suggested that this format could lead to the inconsistencies in the exam difficulty and fairness even in normalization techniques are used. Basically, he said when it comes to this online testing it would be unfair for a lot of students out there it would be unfair to a lot of students out there because when it comes to the online examination some people get easy paper because they get this is basically the reshuffling of computer basic the algorithm of the computer reshuffles the paper okay so by itself only so then uh, some people will get easy paper and some people may get difficult paper because of this so that's the reason he opposed this particular technique also okay and then we say age and attempt limit okay we say my dear friends even if they do it in the upcoming time but that will not be for the need 2025 this is what we are expecting as of now because i have spoken to a lot of educators out there they are saying you cannot expect those things even if they do these changes but not for the need 2025 because less amount of time is left so we cannot say these changes will be implemented in the need 2025 and when it comes to the mode of examination, it will remain unchanged, highly unlikely. Because if they shift to the online mode, they'll have to develop that infrastructure. They'll have to arrange those centers in which computers are present for 27 lakh students in the entire country, which is very much difficult at this point of time. Next, my dear friends, next, my dear friends. We say expectations from NEET 2025. My dear friends, you can see over here, difficulty level would be moderate. These are the things that you can expect for the NEET 2025. Okay. And when it comes to the cutoff, this will be between 620 and 6, 640. Okay. So cutoff won't go higher than this. I have given you, I have told you the details about these previously also. Okay. And section B, we say removed over here that you can basically check in this particular case. So my dear friends, this was all about it. This was all about it. So one more thing I just want to tell you in this particular case, that is NEET 2025 batch by Team Avengers. So this is the batch that we have recently launched. If you want to learn if you want to take the unacademy subscription and you want to give those exams properly so that you can enter into the medical college in the upcoming time these are the batches that are running inside unacademy right now we are teaching in these batches you can enroll as you can enroll as soon as possible okay its price is five triple nine okay and this is need 2026 batch for by team avengers this is for class 11 you can enter in this batch also so thank you so much guys this was all about it take care and bye bye thank you so much